Nautilus Event Center. It'll hold 100 people for weddings, parties of all kinds. We have a great view of the ocean here. Notice the big deck. The wood isn't on it yet, but there'll be uh, three glass doors. This, uh, this area here, over in the corner is where things, uh, you, you keep the folding tables and the chairs. And in here is a kitchen that will have a pass-through from both the beach side and the interior of it. Walking on down, we have four bathrooms, unisex bathrooms, three on the inside and one for the outside. Then we come into what was the old tea room. This is a general store, which is uh, just, we'll have a Coke machine, an ice machine, and uh, toothbrushes and toothpaste, the things that you need. There's an opening to the office there, just so that they can have, but the main office will be right here. This is a check-in counter. The back wall is where the, uh, all of the birdhouses are going to be. And then behind that is an office. Then we're into the main entrance. Coming over here, you come in to the front door here. And uh, this would be the elevator shaft. Unit number four. It's an ADA room. We have two of them. For handicap, uh, the bathroom is in here. We're being wide enough that a wheelchair could go into. And this is the, the balance of the room. This one, unlike the other 10 units, 20 units, uh, will have French doors so that the uh, wheelchairs could go through it. Next door, we have the exact same thing, just flipped. Second ADA row. Then we'll walk on down. Here, this would be the laundry room. And each floor will have its own laundry area. But this is where the main laundry will be done. Uh, that little building in the corner in there is for the fire. Coming through here. They will have it there own bathroom, so they don't have to use the one out in the lobby. And then we're heading into Peggy's apartment. This is Peggy's bedroom. Okay. We'll have this one, we'll have sliding glass doors that go out on a screened-in porch. Showers. All the all the showers will have glass doors, and that's a closet. Now we're walking into Peggy's kitchen and living area. This has a backup bathroom, another closet.
left, a great view of the ocean from here and all my birdhouses. Then we come into the room next to her, which is room number two. And this will have, if she's having company down here, uh, they will have access to her apartment. If I'm not here, then the guy will have access to her apartment. <laughs> Basically the same setup. The other ones, that's a bathroom in their closet. And this will have the same, uh, a smaller kitchen than Peggy's. Basically, that's it. The building takes up 250 feet of beach, including the parking. It has parking that you do not have to back into the 98, you'll be able to pull in, park, and pull out the second exit. There's a total of 24 units all together. Four on the first floor, Cook and Peggy's, and then 10 on the second floor, and 10 on the third floor. And those units will be different in that some of them are a little larger than the other ones. Some of them will have single beds, some of them will have double beds. Some of them are larger kitchens, some of them are smaller kitchens, and uh, I think in most cases there's rooms that tie together, so if you need to rent two rooms, uh, you'll be able to do that. We're back outside, you can see the parking, uh, there will be the entrance, the, the dumpster that's going to be over in that corner and then parking all the way along. There will hopefully be palm trees and what used to be the garden. Uh, what you're looking at basically is floor number one. Uh, floor number two we hope to go up yet next week. Uh, and that will take another couple weeks to go and then we'll go to floor number three. In between time, they'll put the front of the entrance with the stairway and everything else up. And probably the last thing to go up will be the stairs that go up all the way to the top of the floor. So it's exciting. Uh, it's, it's a big undertaking. Stay tuned. Thanks for all your support. We're looking forward to having you down in the spring of next year. Bye.